Go. I'm here with John White Trash Freeland. We just drew lineups for the NCGA. Doesn't he look like a like a, a deformed Captain Picard? <laughs> the NCGA like, first the next first generation. round of the NCGA tournament. We got neutral ground going against Waxha Mixed Martial Arts. Yeah. I would just uh, like to get your opinion on the upcoming duel meet. Well, I mean, we've gone against Waxha, you guys, uh, a couple times, and um, I'm neutral. He's neutral. <laughs> but we're go our team's going against his team, and they have a tough team, just like all eight teams. I mean, they're all they're all great teams from Wisconsin. Uh, of course, we we're going to pick a strategy to beat you guys specifically, just to get through round one. But uh, you know, we'll take it as it comes. It's going to be a good time, and. Uh, with four best technical guys against your best technical guys, and win or lose, we're all in the same family. So luckily, we're in the same family. So if we lose, we lose to our own family. You know, uh, the other the other gyms might be a little bit more, more uh, uh, less family oriented. You know, but uh, losing you guys, we'll be honest. So I'm glad we put, I'm basically I'm glad we drew you first round. So it'll be it'll be a, a tough one right away, and uh, you're not gonna win. <laughs> you can try, but uh, we'll find a way to beat you. You, personally. Right, thank you very much. Again, that's um, March 12th. And it's going to be, uh, doors open at 5, yeah, Saturday, March 12th, doors open at 5.30, and it's going to be here at Waukesha Mixed Martial Arts. Last question, after party, <laughs> beer pong tournament. Yeah, so... Uh, you and your best student... It has to be me personally. Yep. Okay, I can't, I can't uh, delegate maybe two of my best guys at beer pong versus... No. Okay. Me and Reese will be representing the Waukesha gym. I've played the game once. <laughs> Reese has probably played zero times. I, uh, okay, well then I'll choose my partner uh, between now and then. I'll choose them based on their ability and, and we'll find a way to beat you. And we'll practice. That's the thing is we'll practice every day. Beer pong. We, we played uh, screwdriver pong. We played jack and coke pong. I'm pretty sure your, your skills will fall short of that. Now, all the other teams were talking about neutral ground getting a handicap in the beer pong tournament. <laughs> Any, uh, any comments on that? I want to understand why we would get a handicap. You guys actually have to shoot your ping pongs into shot glasses, where they technically won't even fit in there. Why? You do you still think you can win? Yeah. But, but, By the way, that's Adrian Serrano's idea. I think it's a good one, though. Adrian Smadrian, I want to understand why you think we need a handicap. Well, I've uh, known the neutral ground guys for quite a while, and if anybody doesn't know, they, they all have... Large, large <laughs> drinking problem. Here's the thing. That this is exactly why we, should, you guys should have a handicap because we drink so much we probably can't hit a bong, uh, a pier, hit a bong. That's a different team. Hit, oh. hit, 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 a, hit, a, hit a hit a a, a ping pong ball in a, in a in a cup. We drink. We're professional drinkers, not players of games while passively drinking. We drink to get messed up. We don't drink to play games. Oh. So maybe you guys should have a handicap because you guys are probably sober, sipping on your whatever. I assume that, that if your team actually you played sober, you wouldn't do good. Well, we, we don't play games. We don't play games. We drink heavily, and we do dumb things. We make bad decisions. We don't play anything that takes coordination. But we'll accept the handicap you're going to give it. Either way, we'll find a way to win, just like we will in the uh, dual meet. Awesome. Again, that's March 12th, Saturday, March 12th, here at Watch MMA. Thank you again. For sure.